इट्स वेल गुड आफ्टरनून एवरी वन वेलकम यू अगेन इन द लेक्चर टू दैट इज सेंटिमेंट एनालिसिस एंड टेक्स्ट क्लासिफिकेशन सो वी हैव ऑलरेडी नोन अबाउट द एल एल एम्स चार्जिपिटी इन लेक्चर नंबर वन नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट द एन एल पी दैट इज नेचुरल लैंग्वेज प्रोसेसिंग सो एन एल पी इज नथिंग बट इट इज अ ब्रांच ऑफ आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस फोकस्ड ऑन एनाबलिंग कंप्यूटर्स टू अंडरस्टैंड इंटरप्रेट एंड रेस्पॉन्ड टू ह्यूमन लैंग्वेज एन एल पी हैज रिवोल्यूशनाइज हाउ मशीन्स इंट्रैक्ट विद पीपल बाय ब्रिजिंग द कम्युनिकेशन गैप बिटवीन ह्यूमन्स एंड कंप्यूटर्स इट प्लेज अ क्रुशियल रोल इन अ वराइटी ऑफ एप्लीकेशन्स फ्रॉम वर्चुअल एसिस्टेंट्स टू लैंग्वेज ट्रांसलेशन टूल्स सो वी विल बी फोकसिंग ऑफ ऑन द टूडेज लेक्चर अबाउट द पावरफुल एप्लीकेशन ऑफ एन एल पी वन इज सेंटिमेंट एनालिसिस अनदर इज टेक्सट क्लासिफिकेशन these applications are widely used across industries providing valuable insights and improving decision making processes so you must know what is the meaning of sentiment analysis sentiment analysis refers to the process of analyzing text data to determine the emotional tone behind it so it answers questions like uh, is the opinion positive negative or natural neutral so how do people feel about a product service or event it's also known as opinion mining now question is how does it work so sentiment analysis involves extracting subjective information from text it uses machine learning models lexicons and deep learning techniques to classify sentiments text is broken into units that is words phrases sentences and then algorithms evaluate each piece for its emotional value now another question is why is it important for us so there are so many reasons first one like we can consider as a customer feedback so businesses can access customer opinions about products or services another is a brand monitoring so if we talk about the companies they can track how people feel about their brand in real time also we can do public opinion analysis so governments and organizations can understand public sentiment on policies or events etc so the natural question is uh, how industry is using this tool so automated systems access customer satisfaction and root complaints in healthcare understanding patient emotions in feedback for better care is very important like in finance sector monitoring market sentiment to make investment decisions so text classification what is the meaning of text classification do you have any idea think about it so i'm going to explain uh, text classification is the process of organizing text into predefined categories or labels so what it do it helps to automatically tag or short so uh, short large volumes of unstructured data now you must know how does it work it involves training models on labeled data allowing them to learn patterns and classify new data accurately these methods include rule based approaches machine learning models deep learning methods like cnns rnns transformers so another question is why is it important so it is important because of many point of views like efficiency scalability and accuracy so how efficiency work these tools automates the sorting and labeling of data reducing manual efforts 
and uh, in terms of scalability it can handle large data sets with minimal human intervention next for accuracy it improves over time with more data and better models for industry use cases spam detection it classifies emails as spam or not so it is very important to do sentiment analysis using these tools okay now sentiment analysis is also known as opinion mining that we have already uh, understand uh, understood in uh, lecture number 1 so it is a uh, in short it is a key task in natural language processing that involves identifying extracting and classifying emotions or opinions expressed in a piece of text it aims to determine the emotional tone behind words sentences or entire documents to understand the attitude or sentiment of the writer or a speaker the core goal is to categorize opinions as positive negative or neutral now most important question is why sentiment analysis matters so sentiment analysis plays a vital role across different industries by enabling business governments and organizations to understand public opinion customer emotions and trends in real time it helps in decision making by converting unstructured text into valuable insights business thrive on customer satisfaction and sentiment analysis helps track feedback in real time and that is very very important for any growth structure and instead of relying solely on surveys companies can automatically analyze customer emotions across social media post product reviews support tickets and customer emails so text classification what is the meaning of text classification we have already discussed it involves categorizing text into predefined labels or groups it is one of the core task in nlp and is widely used in spam detection topic labeling language detection and more for example consider when you receive an email your email service automatically classifies it as a spam or not a spam based on its content similarly news articles can be sorted into categories like polit the uh, politics sports or health text classification systems use supervised machine learning where they are trained or labeled data sets so algorithms like nevbase svm and deep learning models like cnns rnns are often used you must be knowing that the goal is to make sense of massive amounts of text data quickly and accurately now what is the meaning of text classification it is the process of categorizing text into different groups now consider one example suppose in spam in in case of emails is spam or not a spam so this is the categorization is spam or not a spam similarly in the news articles is sports politics health etc so it helps in organizing information and automating the decisions now what is the importance of text classification the text classification is a fundamental task in natural language processing it involves automatically assigning predefined categories or labels to unstructured text data with the explosion of digital information manual classification of documents emails and other text based content is no longer feasible so text classification provides a scalable fast and accurate solution that helps organizations make sense of vast amount of data so now one question comes in our mind that how text classification works 
So at its core, text classification relies on machine learning algorithms and NLP techniques to understand that context of text, to identify key themes or topics, to categorize the data into relevant classes. And these approaches include rule-based systems, machine learning models, deep learning models. Now question is why is the text classification important? that we, have, we are uh, were already discussing. So as data volumes grows, manual handling is impractical. Text, so text classification offers us time saving, cost efficiency, improved accuracy, scalability and real time decision making. So it is very important for all of us. Now, what is the use case in financial market analysis? So in finance, sentiment analysis is used to track market sentiment. Investors and traders rely heavily on news, reports and social media chatter to make investment decisions. So sentiment analysis tools scan millions of news, headlines, social media posts and financial reports in real time to go market mood. For example, if news breaks about a company's poor quarterly earnings. Sentiment analysis tools can immediately flag a negative market sentiment. Now, text classification helps short and prioritize financial documents such as earnings reports or regulatory fillings. This enables faster decision making and improves the trading strategies as traders can react promptly to change in sentiment and market news. So, in customer service, sentiment analysis and text classification are game changers. Business often receive thousands of customer queries, reviews and social media comments daily. So it is very big challenge. The sentiment analysis tools scan these messages to detect customer sentiments automatically. If a customer leaves negative feedback on social media, the tool flags it allowing customer service teams to respond quickly. Text classification can categorize the type of query, billing issue, technical support or feedback and route it to the correct department. This leads to quicker response times, higher customer satisfaction and better resource allocation. Now companies like Amazon, Zappos use these tools extensively to maintain high levels of customer satisfaction. Now, healthcare has increasingly adopted AI tools and NLP plays a huge role here. Sentiment analysis in healthcare helps girls, uh, patients' emotional well-being. For example, patient surveys or feedback can reveal insights about their mental health, whether they are experiencing stress, anxiety or depression. So doctors can use this information to provide timely interventions. Text classification in healthcare helps organize and categorize patient records, clinical notes or often unstructured text. So AI can classify these into categorize, categories like uh, symptoms, diagnosis and treatments. This helps doctors quickly find relevant information, improving the speed and accuracy of diagnosis and treatment planning. So, at the end, now we can summarize what we learn. The sentiment analysis and text classification are two fundamental applications of NLP that are making a real impact in many industries. They enable businesses to understand customer emotions, classify and manage vast amount of data and make informed decisions quickly. In customer service, they improve response times and customer satisfaction. In healthcare, they assist in diagnosis, uh, diagnosing uh, emotional health issues and organizing medical records. In finance, they provide real-time market insights and help predict market trends. The potential for NLP in these areas continues to grow as AI models improve. So thank you for watching.
this lecture number two if you have any query you can put your queries on my email id namita tiwari at the rate csgmu.ac.in so thank you for watching thank you so much